Hey guys, it's Luis for Bus Voyage, and today I'm going to be showing you how to remove your rear heater. Now, I hesitated on doing this for a little while, but after a bunch of research, I decided it will actually help a lot with my floor plan and won't harm my bus in any way. So I'm going to do it, and I'm going to show you how to do it as well. The first thing to do is get some hose that matches your heater hose. Mine was 5 eighths of an inch. Cut a small length of that and slide a clamp over each end. Next, put an elbow fitting into each end and screw that clamp down. Now you've successfully made the piece that will loop your heater lines back together. Do a quick water check and make sure everything's nice and tight. Now that you've made a little fitting to loop your coolant lines back together, we're going to get up under the bus and locate the heater's hoses. Trace them to a place where they'll be easy to cut and prepare yourself mentally and spiritually for what you're about to do. Make sure you have a bucket underneath to catch the coolant that leaks out so you can dispose of it properly later. Once you've cut your hose, you're going to want to slip a hose clamp on one end of it Get the fitting you made and insert it into the hose. <clears throat> After screwing that bad boy Here down, place it up somewhere where it won't leak coolant out and proceed to cut your other hose. Back. Repeat the same exact process for Here. the second hose. Insert the other end of your fitting and you will have successfully looped your coolant lines together. This lets you rip out your rear heater while keeping the front one for heat while driving and defrosting your windshield. Now, trace the hose back to where it connects to the heater and go ahead and cut that off. Make sure to cut the electrical wire running to it as well. Back inside of the bus, you're going to need to remove the screws holding the heater down into the ground. I was able to use a drill for two, but needed an extendable ratchet for the others. And of course, all the parts that I'm using will be down in the description. Ah. Careful not to cut yourself, y'all. Tetanus is no joke. Finally, we can rip that rear heater out. Oh, yes. Please leave a comment if you have any questions or suggestions, and good luck. Hey guys, thanks so much for checking out this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell button for new videos every Thursday. And if you want to learn more about the bus conversion process, or you just enjoy watching us do it, feel free to watch some more of our videos. Over here, or over here. <laughs> that felt pretty good.